groups don't just form the basis of much dance music and hip-hop. They're a great way to build a song, provide inspiration for songwriting, or even throw together a quick soundtrack. Mixcraft includes well over 6,000 loops and sound effects, with new, free content added from time to time. Click on a loop to audition it. If you don't have the loop already installed on your computer, Mixcraft will download the loop file automatically and store it on your hard drive. You can also right-click to download every loop in a category. Note that the boxed versions of Mixcraft already include all of the loop files. Inspiration isn't patient, so you need a fast, efficient way to find the loops you want when you want them. You can sort loops by various criteria, such as tempo, key, style, instrument, and even by song kits that contain related loops for a particular musical style. Great for soundtracks and songwriting. Similarly, you can sort sound effects to find music beds, ambiences, and more. You can also search. For example, to find all guitar loops in the key of E, select the key, then type guitar in the search box. That's a lot of guitars, so you can narrow it to only acoustic guitars, or only leads, or only leads at 120 beats per minute. Search within all loops, or just specific kits, or look in specific styles. Mixcraft's audio engine can stretch a loop's tempo and key to conform to your song's current tempo and key. If you bring in a loop whose tempo and or key differs from the current project, a dialog box appears. Click Yes to conform the song to the loop, or No to conform the loop to the song. Unless the amount of stretching is extreme, the stretched loop should sound fine. Bring in more loops. Add loops from other kits. Click and drag the loop to extend it. Or add another iteration by clicking on the loop's Add One Loop button. Rearrange the loops. And more. You can import your own loops or loops from libraries. Click on Import, browse for the folder containing the loops, then click OK. Choose the desired import options, then click Import. You can edit the attributes of imported loops, too. Click on Edit Library. The pencil icon next to the name means it can be edited. Let's indicate that these are guitar loops, as they were so processed Mixcraft couldn't guess the source. You can also enter keywords, or if you imported a loop without tempo information, enter the tempo for future reference. To create a loop and add it to the library, bring the audio you want to convert to a loop into a project. This clip is 4 measures at 125 BPM and in the key of E, but it lasts more than 4 measures in this 140 BPM project because the tempo is faster. The easiest way to stretch the loop tempo is to hold down the control key. Hover the mouse over the clip edge until the cursor turns into the Flex Audio hands, then drag until it's exactly four measures. But you can also make this loop part of your loop library with a little prep work. Double-click on the loop to open the Sound tab. Choose Adjust to Project Tempo and enter the audio's native tempo in this case, 125 beats per minute. Mixcraft has now stretched the audio to last exactly four measures at the project tempo. With melodic parts, also enter the key. Right-click on the clip and select Add to Library. Choose the library where you want to import the file, and if appropriate, a default song kit. You can optionally apply any existing effects or clip envelopes before adding the clip to the library. Now, when you bring this loop into any project from the library, it will conform to the project tempo and key.
Thank you.